Let's do some politics now, shall we? Because the former president, John Dramani Mahama, has taken a swipe at President Okufuado for defending government's borrowing uh, to finance its programs and policies. Speaking at an entrepreneurship forum organized by the Tony Elumelu Foundation in Nigeria last week, the president mentioned that Ghana will continue to borrow to put up projects he described as assets, adding that many developed countries borrow including the United States. They even borrow as well, he says. But addressing delegates of the Trobo constituency to kickstart his five-day campaign tour of the Greater Accra region, the former president, um, uh, the former president says that um, President Ekufado must apologize to Ghanaians for lying to them. When we criticize them, they don't understand. You understand? The problem is not that something is bad. Nobody ever said borrowing is bad. When we were in government, we never said borrowing was bad. You borrow to invest in assets. And everybody knows that. And when we were in government, we borrow to invest in assets. We build hospitals, we build roads, we build interchanges. We extended electricity, we did water, we expanded the ports. We did all those projects. It was they who said borrowing was bad. So when Ghanaians are criticizing you today, it is because of what you said in the past. It is the hypocrisy that Ghanaians are angry with. And we have all your quotations about borrowing. You say any idiot can borrow. That's what you said. You know? And you said the money is here. We don't need to borrow to develop Ghana. So today if you have turned around and you see that, oh, you can borrow and invest in assets, the first thing you do is you apologize to Ghanaians and say, oh, we didn't know. We are sorry. Now we will borrow. But when you behave as if we are idiots, we don't remember what you said, and you say, oh, we will borrow. Even U.S. is borrowing. Of course, U.S. is borrowing. So what? And that's just the, the first day of uh, the former president's uh, campaign tour of the Great Okra region. It's five days, and uh, we'll see how it pans out. And it's just the off-season. It's not even the political season yet. But it's a race for the NDC to 2020.